Hi, I'm Tom Molini. I'm partnering with Figma to help teachers transition from Jamboard to FigJam. In this video, let's look at the share button. So you're in a Jamboard jam, you click share, and there you have the ability to change the audience and what all people can do. So restricted anyone with the link or your school. And so you can do that. If I do anyone with the link, then they can view or edit and you can add specific people right there as well. Okay. Let's look at what the FigJam share button does. So when we click on the purple share button in FigJam, it's basically in the same spot. We click share. And here we have the option, anyone with the link, anyone with the link and password. So you can password protect your FigJams. It's true. Yes, you can do that. Uh, or you can only invite, you know, only people invited to this file. The other thing that's really impressive is this is that you can just start a an, 24-hour an editing session. It's open to anyone, so anyone with the link can edit, but it goes away in 24 hours. So you can do this with your class, and then don't even worry about resetting it to only students can only view because it just ends in 24 hours. How nice is that? One other thing I'll call your attention to here is that there is a get embed so you can embed in websites, something you can't do in Jamboard. So I really hope you enjoy all these nice features that are living right here at the share button. So, so powerful in FigJam. Before I go, I wanna shout out my partner Figma. If you wanna get started with FigJam in the classroom, go to figma.com slash ed education. If you wanna try the amazing FigJam classroom templates, go to figma.com slash at education. And if you want to try out FigJam right now, just type figjam.new into your browser. Thanks so much for watching and enjoy transitioning from Jamboard to FigJam.